Okay, this is Luigi Tramontana from Craft Animations. I am giving you a turbo tutorial on the angular play. Let's see what that funny thing does. Well, it might look a little bit strange in the beginning. What are these things? Well, everything that's red, you can parent to something. And this is a cone. You can scale it however you like, and this piece here will keep in the center of the cone and just uh, stay in put until it reaches the end there. That sounds esoteric but I will show you in greater detail what it actually does. So let's just scale this in a little way like that. So yeah, okay. That means that this part here will keep within these limits. However, to make it work you must uh, parent this to something. So I will actually create a um, uh, direct input link here and uh, parent this thing to the the actuator here so that I can move it with it. Now the next thing I do here is simply to well I can bind the yeah it's not bound so let's see your your and pitch those are the important ones so your and pitch up down like that okay so let's see what happens now if i make this thing work let's put on some wireframes so that it's easier to look at let's move this from the grid. Yeah, this one will jump. Let's pick this one with us. Like that. Okay, so what does this thing do now? Well, if I hit record here and move this up and down, you see, when it comes to the end, it just uh, stays there. The same goes for the, the edges here. It glides on the edges actually, so if I do like this, so it will always keep in the center of it. And this is all being animated now, so... Uh, and I see here that um, we have a dependence. This is important in, three, in uh, Craft Director Studio, that uh, the angular play is actually dependent on the direct input link's position at the moment. So this is the correct way to, to Simulate, simulate this one after this one has moved. Otherwise you have these delay effects that you saw there. So let's do that again. Like so, yeah. So now it keeps straight. It doesn't move from that cone. So that's all you have to do with this one. And uh, you use it to for, I mean a play is something in a machinery that uh, sort of does not uh, go back to its original position. So that's what this is for, to give this a little play for the mechanical stuff to, to play in. Okay, thank you very much.